How do we sound? Testing, testing, one, two, three. Uh, um, I just texted someone TTYL. Oh. Never done that before. TTYL is good. It's straight it's right to the point. It means talk to you later. Channel news. <laughs> Annie is training the very mm. capable Julia. Everyone give Julia a round of applause and say hello. <laughs> Julia, if you could look over there and just wave. <laughs> Hi. It's to the eight. 18 million subscribers. <laughs> we don't have 18 million subscribers. The streamy nominations came out. We did not get nominated, um, which I am not fine with. No, you were uh, a little bitter. Yeah. I probably should watch some other YouTube content to see if maybe, you know, they're doing awesome stuff, but I just can't imagine anyone's doing anything more awesome. Do we have any other channel news? Literally one more episode of Renovation Station. One more. One or to two. two more. And then what is going to happen is we are going to just start posting so much content. Your brains are going to melt and we're going to really aim for six reactions a month plus other stuff. TBD. We'll be recording our podcast. Lots the other stuff. TBD. Oh. Yeah, I don't know if it's a surprise or whatever, but yeah. And then super big surprise. All right. Well, let's let's jump into this. I mean, there's so much to talk about. I but, know. You know. Whoa! Five ah. weeks later, we need a little bit of a recap, but well, stand by. I mean, five weeks earlier. What episode are we on? 413. So I don't think we've, we've seen, seen any of this. We haven't. I did not see that new girl. No. Uh, I don't know what happened to Sam and Emily. So now we're into fresh. We've never done this before. Sam and Juliet. Um. Sam and Emily are our friends. Yes. <laughs> See ya. He's always in like a bad place. Like I get that, Whoa, but oh, what do you think of her doing? hair? Um, it's the thick blonde streak, <sighs> but but uh, but uh, she looks gorge. Her skin's amazing. Does she eat and leave no crumbs? I don't use that thing. Things that are literally ruining your life. I wasn't even gonna say anything because I didn't even care that much, but Chloe screamed it out. Why the f is that her place? This is why I can't. It definitely is not her place. I don't. Did think. you just say Deffy? I don't see a world where we're ever gonna be friends again. So, well, she has a new boyfriend, so that's like Does keeping she? her occupied. I think he's really good for her because like they have the same interests and stuff. Like with the. We have seen Chloe with a boyfriend. <sighs> Uh -huh. <laughs> you know, journey and... They're both on a journey? They're both on a journey. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. As long as she's on her journey and not like bothering us, I think, it, you know, that's good. <laughs> yeah, let's hope that's the way it stays. She will probably be at Juliet's birthday beach bash. Is she bringing the boyfriend? Yeah, I think so. I'd like to meet him. I would Ooh. love to meet him. Yeah, I'm sure you would. Um, fun. Were the two of them friends? I don't think they had much of a history, so I think they're fine. And right. they are a good combo. They are, I, yes, yeah. I like them. They're both outspoken. Mm -hmm. Oh, shoot, I've never seen her kiss anyone. I know. Our second vacation in two months since knowing each other. Mm -hmm. I've seen this Ever dude. Since all right, so we're not into fresh. Reactions. But maybe, maybe, maybe not that. But I feel like maybe we stopped midway here because we were like, let's, let's save, save this. I, I, but obviously, we're don't close. quote me. This was like very deep COVID times. No, chicken boy. I mean, that was a total brownout phase. Yes, yes, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Chloe has a new guy. She was in a really long term relationship prior to this that didn't end well. I have a boyfriend. Really? Cutter? No! Guy, guy from Ohio? No. It's like really serious, like I feel like I've met my soulmate. But this is literally what you said about the last one. <laughs> she said Same. she was sure about Chris this time. But a lot of us didn't want to see Chloe put all her energy into this relationship just to get hurt again. I'm just not as anxious, I'm not as worried. You help me stay present and I think that's what's important. Well you help me a lot too. We share a connection that, I mean, I literally have had butterflies and I've seen butterflies since meeting you. And I, you know how much I believe in symbolism and the best things in life do take a little bit of trust in the universe. And 
I'm just following my heart. All right, guys, we're pulling for you. Mm -hmm. I feel like ever since I met you, I've just been kind of living in this like fairy tale and I haven't really seen many of my friends and we've just kind of been living in our own little world. But now, when we go back home to Siesta Key, you're gonna meet a lot of my friends. Yeah. Do they like live in Cabo now? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Or are you cool. just saying, yeah, but, but, or is that true? Oh, uh, I'm just saying, yeah. I oh. think it, they said it's their second trip. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so just be prepared for people to pry a little bit. These people have known me for a really long time and there's a little bit of skeptical, skepticalism still of my still journey. Not a word. Yeah. There's that picture of a caterpillar turning into a butterfly and the caterpillar is saying, you've changed. And the butterfly says, we're supposed to. <laughs> you know what I mean, dog? He's like, you get that? Do you know that, that one? Make it easier. What up, mom? Why is Brandon's mom always coming to do scenes with Brandon at I Brandon's mean, dad's house? She must not want to film at her house. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, none of us had really seen Brandon since the reunion. Everything that went down in New York really upset him, so he was just ghosting all of us. Oh, you got some Indian food. Yeah, yeah. So that's my Quincy. Quincy's good. He's getting older. Like, he was crazy. almost walking when I saw him last time. He's like getting there. He's like standing up. He'll like take a step and then fall. He's just like more vocal now. You can see his full personality, you know? In that do rag. Just like Pops. But he's, he's doing good. Good. How is everything going since New York? Uh, not good. I mean, I, I just I just messed up again. I just messed up again. I hooked up with Jordana again, you know? And I mean, it wasn't right because I was still talking to Camilla. And the next day, it got brought up by the host. I didn't own up to my <laughs> Chloe ran their mouth and set me up and sabotaged me. And it just oh, your hair. blew up in my face once again, you know? Yo, mom, it's yeah, time. You yeah, you need to lay down the law. But you had been talking to Camilla, and when you don't own up to it, and then you get caught in that situation again, aren't you over that? I, I really, really am. I'm, I'm so tired of lying. It's not anyone's fault, it's my fault because I keep giving in. Mm -hmm. You know, because I, like, I have a problem saying no. There's gonna always be people knocking on your door and you have to make a decision whether or not to let them in. Mm -hmm. And when you do something, you just have to own it. Don't try and skirt around it, just own it. Mm -hmm. Have you talked to anybody since you've been back from New York? Or? I mean, not really. Sam and Juliet invited me to come to like their party but with Camilla, with Jordana, with everyone that I've done wrong. I don't know, I don't even want to be around anyone right now, you know? Not mm. for you. Well, how are you gonna be on your TV show? Yeah. I think I just need to let them, you know, move on and, and not have me around for a little bit. Doesn't work that way, Maybe Brandon. he doesn't really want to be on the TV show. Mm, he wants to get paid for the TV show. I know, show. but if he knew what was best for him, he would quit the TV show. Hey, Bella. How are you, love? I'm good. Doesn't sound good. Mm. What's going on? Nothing. My birthday's coming up. Mm, yes, I know. 24. Oh, well, many a, more. Yeah, it's a big one. I think Sam's gonna throw me a birthday party, but I'm kind of, I'm just feeling kind of weird about it. Oh. So, you know, I, you, you know, not sure you want a big party or a... Is 24 a big birthday? No, no, it's not. Well, honestly, I am struggling right now. I feel like I'm spread so thin. I have like no energy. And the reality of the situation is like, I'm trying to grow a business, but it's hard living with Sam because there's always people there. There's a lot going on. And it's like, I really want to focus on JMP the label. And it's just, I don't know what to do because I feel like I'm not happy living there anymore. And I feel like I might need to move out. Is she gonna try and move out and not break up? Yes. Oh. <laughs> um. Yeah. I mean, I want to focus on a place where I don't ever have to actually rely on Sam. And I think that is something he doesn't quite understand. I, I absolutely feel the same way. I mean, yeah. you should be independent, be able to leave, have your own means, and right. I 100% support you on that. 
I just don't know how he's gonna take it if I do actually move out. Can't I imagine. can tell you. It's gonna be good. No, he's probably gonna. So y you still love him? Yeah, I do. No, you mm. don't. Do. No, no, you don't. Like, I don't want to break up, but I, I think this is the best thing for our future, you know? Like, I don't want to just throw away our relationship because it's hard to live together. Juliet, you know, it's, sometimes it could be difficult for some men to have to deal with a person that is as independent and strong-willed as you are. And violent. Once you talk to him, it, it may affect the relationship and it may not go on. You may lose him over this. That could be the end of it. Are you ready for that? I feel like she wants to break up with him without really breaking up with him. So just this is like an easy him. way to do just it. Yeah, just break up with him. Best friends. <laughs> Don't talk to us or me. These pants are way too tight. No more cookies. No more cookies. <laughs> cheers. Cheers, baby. Cheers to us. Always cheers to you. Cheers to us. Wow. Cheers to Blend. Yeah, cheers yeah. to Blend. I'm excited for Juliet's party. You know who's going to be there? Chloe and her new boyfriend. And the new boyfriend, dude. That's gonna be so weird to see her bring a boyfriend to a party. It's just never happened before. Like, not even close. I feel bad for Chloe now. Like, they're like planning on... Being mean. Yeah. They're going overboard. Yeah, I, don't like that. Yeah. I mean, it's obviously the beat that they're given, but mm -hmm. now I'm on Chloe's side. <laughs> I wonder who has more crystals stuck up their ass. Is it her or Chris? Only one way to find out, Jordana. <laughs> they're gonna look up their holes. the first park day? Well, we've gone to the beach a lot. Yeah, we do a lot of beach days, but not a lot of park days. You know, nature heals me and makes me feel good. I know. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm glad I moved here. Me too. A little bit of a lot. Siesta Key is like always a good time. It is. It's always a party. Um, speaking of partying, you're about to go in the poop. Juliet, whose birthday we're going to. What'd you say? You're, you're about to go in the poop? Let's rewind that one. You're about to go in the poop. Juliet, whose birthday we're going to, everyone will be there. I'm not sure if Sarah will be there or not. Matcha. girl that doesn't really know you but likes to talk about you? Yes. Yeah. I'm never going to be friends with someone like that again. Like, she doesn't think the way, like, a normal person thinks. Kara and Chloe used to be really close. Hi. Oh. I have things for you to make you You're feel so better. You're so sweet. <laughs> do a treat for your feet. Yes. yes. After yesterday, we need it. But Chloe spread a rumor about Kara cheating on Garrett. I know for a fact that Kara's been going up to New Jersey and hooking up with her ex and cheating on Garrett all the time. Kara found out and lost her mind. I'd like to know who you think I cheated on that kid with. I'd love to hear it. So I'm not going to be made out to be a cheater. I'm out of here. And while Chloe had apologized for all of that, I said you cheated on Garrett, and I do not know that for sure. It was horrible, and I'm sorry. It was too little, too late for Kara. Will we ever be actual friends again? No. Like, you don't treat people like that. You don't treat anybody She's like that. She's so disrespectful for no reason. Yeah. Kara loves to point out that, like, I'm not a changed person and, like, I'm just manipulating everyone into thinking I'm a changed person. Are these two giving you brother-sister vibes? The answer is yes. Yeah, I'm definitely not getting lover vibes. Anyone that knows me Present. knows. Future. Exactly. Exactly. But I worry because I still yeah. do allow things We're to healing. trigger me. And I feel like Kara's like on the prowl to like prove that I haven't changed. So she is. <laughs> I know, babe. His like namaste it's, even annoys her. I mean, yeah, she has to she remind giggles. herself. She's like, wait, I'm pretending to be this way. Yeah. But it's not always easy to be like that. So I think before we speak, someone says something, we take a breath, right? Breath of life calms us down. She hates him. Grounds us. Mm -hmm. It's a, a quick little mini meditation. I mean, that's ex that's I'm great advice. He's gonna, like, keep her in check if he's like that kind of boyfriend. Like maybe she'll like a... be really calm and like nice and normal with yeah. him around. If Kara tries to get her eyes out of me, I can promise I'll just walk away. Awesome. Yeah. I'm so High mad five. at that. Life coach vibes. Mm -hmm. I feel like she treats you like an ex-boyfriend. Or like a current boyfriend. Yeah. 
Maybe she's low-key obsessed with you. Are you obsessed with me? That's the only person I want to be obsessed with me. I am. <laughs> At least I'm not mean to you. I definitely want to apologize for what I said in New York. You know, I'm not perfect, and I still make mistakes, and I still slip up, and I'm, like, nervous for you to see that side of me. Because I don't want you to, but also, like, I can't hide it. But I don't know. I don't know. It's all about progress. I know. It's, we're, I'm looking at the bigger picture, not about little things that happen. I love challenges, and I like to overcome things. I think that's the male archetype, is just to overcome challenges and be a spiritual warrior. Male archetype, you are it. What are you doing here? Yeah. How are you? Good. Good to see you. So Brandon and Camilla went away together on a romantic trip. And then he cheated on her? Oh my God. So horrible. And it seemed like they were falling back in love. Of course, until all of the reunion issues came out, so they hadn't talked since then. Um, I don't even know where to start. I, feel, I don't even know, like, um, I've made a lot of mistakes, but what I'm here to do today is to just say, like, look, I'm sorry for New York. I sort of, like, I've put you through a lot, so much that I feel bad for. What I've done to you is horrible, and I don't want to put anyone through that ever again. You know, it's like I gave you another chance. That was so much for me to do that for you. I felt so stupid after. Yeah. I was having fun with Will. He brought me happiness. I know. Put that in my face. It's all good. I understand. And then you literally, like, hook up with Jordana, which completely blindsided me. It was a mistake even trying again. I mean, I live with those mistakes, and I can't go back and change anything, and I just want to make the right decisions moving forward. I hope you can figure that out for yourself, for your next relationship you have. Yeah, get him, bug, get him. You can't control yourself. No, I, and I understand that, and that is why I've been trying to just work on myself. I feel like I just want to take a little time to myself to figure out, I don't know, just to be happy, get back to being happy. Are you gonna come to Juliet's party? No, 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 I don't want to be like awkward and you know? I, I haven't really seen anybody in a while. Just doing my thing, that's really it. Well, I'm glad, you know, you asked me to come out here. I'm and glad you came. Yeah. Do you want to go you on wanna a date? Go? I know, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We're not meant to be together, it's fine. And I wish you nothing but the best. Let's just try not to have all this tension when we're around each other. I should probably get going. So it was nice to see you. Maybe Camilla needed this, you know? Yeah. Like, she seems pretty confident okay with it. that, you know, this guy is not for her. Mm -hmm. And maybe she just needed two episodes of cheating. Whose house is this? His? Who's his? No, he had a way more modern house. Who's Sam's. He? No. Maybe we got a new house. Sam's new house? Mm hmm. That cheese, cheese was really no, sweaty. Yeah, I've been out to it for too long. <laughs> cheese has been such a storyline in our life. Uh -huh. Party's here. Party's here. Well. Let's go grab a drink. Oh, that's exactly, girl. Exactly. House is this? She came late to her party. Aren't you usually the first person at your party and you greet people? Not if you get like an Airbnb. Have you seen Sam? I assumed he would be here when I got here. He wears tightest shirt. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. 
Oh, hey, girlfriend. <laughs> 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 Should we just go back to the Hudson Bank? Yeah. Wow. Is he drunk? Shut up. He's drunk. Uh-huh. I don't mind it. It's a birthday show. Hey, hey, to keep it, your enemies closer than your friends. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> what? He knows what's up. Like, as annoying as Chloe is, and like, as much as I don't believe about her journey, I always want... The best for people? Yeah, like, it's nice to see her with a guy, even if it's not the right guy, and like, it's not gonna work out. Like, it's nice that she is, you know, out there trying to live happy. her life. Yeah, yeah and happy. Agreed. And like, I think if people are happy, then they stop, you know, tormenting other people. Yeah, it's true. Why does he look like the ex-boyfriend? What number boyfriend is this? Yeah, do you like us in our tour too, though? You look so cute! Yeah, be nice. So be nice. Yeah. Be nice. I'm like, do you know what you're getting yourself into, buddy? Just sit back and enjoy the show. So it's great to finally meet you. Thank you so much uh, for yes. coming. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Yeah. Good for her birthday. It's hot. I'm going to shut up. Oh, so you're going to shut up. Cheers. Amanda. Sam's drunk. Eyes off. I'm dead. We went to Cabo. You guys have to find me a boyfriend next. <laughs> oh my god. What do you think of Will for me? I really like Will. He's cool. I would love to be here with him. He seems like a great guy. So after the first time Brandon cheated on Camilla, she rebounded with Will. What can I kiss you in Italian? Posso avere un bacio. Vaso un bacio un bacio. But then she dropped him to give BG another chance. But now that Camilla and Brandon were over again, who knows? Did you miss me? Did you? Did you guys hook up after Sam's party? Did you guys hook up? Are you telling people that you were trying to get me to skydive? Yes. I had like 40 something jumps. Every time we see each other, we're just like, like super, like, exactly. It's just like super natural, like chill. Yeah. I got yanked away from him and my Whoa, back. Look, look at Amanda. She's coming in hot. I promise you, if you go once, you're going to love it. Reach what out would, a little bit. What would you? <laughs> Jump out of the sky. Do something crazy, Will. What? I'm going to throw something at him. I'll if I choose to have a plane, you go skydiving? Yeah. Deal. Amanda's always flirting with Camilla's boyfriend. Always. Like, she's always kind of flirting with everyone's boyfriends. She's trying to find her. She knows. Uh huh. Can I throw this crack around him? You gotta do something to the Pinterest. Amanda, what are you doing? Camilla! What's up, guys? What's up? Why are you throwing crackers? You looked hungry. Guys, did he look hungry? Honestly, he looked I'm... a little thirsty. He looked. Oh, who's this girl from the corner? What's going on? I don't know. Camilla's mad at Will. What, Will? What do you have to say? I know you have something at the tip of your tongue. Let's hear it. Basso un bacio. Do you and Brandon still talk? <laughs> no, but that has nothing to do with right now. What? I got a better question. She just lied. Oh, and Chloe's about to start some sh which her new boyfriend is not mm -mm. gonna like. He's like, Chloe, mm -mm. do not. Mm -mm. Did you two like four days ago? Chloe. Yeah, we did. Will, where have you been? You don't hit me up. You don't text me at all. Where's the effort? Brandon and Camilla had sex four days no, ago? No, him. These two. These two, right? Oh. Yes. Or else he would he be like livid right now. I see you want me to chase. Yeah, every girl wants to be chased. So I look desperate as hell and be like, hey, for tonight's lineup, Camilla has Will and BG. Yeah. All right, no, I don't know. Yo, you guys want to take some shots? Should we, Sam, do you want a shot? Don't give Sam another shot. what you want. That wasn't nice. No. I mean, she shouldn't have thrown a cracker at him either, but like. No. Party looks fun. Not anymore. You're being fine. I am, are you? I am. Exactly. Yes, you are. <laughs> I love you. I love you. Keep <laughs> drunk. 
I hate friends that I barely know. <laughs> yeah. I like that. So, does anyone, you want to say sorry at all? Nice. Oh my God. Probably not. Jordan, say sorry. like when we were in New York, if I was a little harsh, I'm sorry, but you know I love you. But if you love me, why are you saying about me with that? Like, like how rude is that? It's like you're literally the same person. You have not changed. It hurts. Are you a psychologist? I don't think you have the right to comment on whether I'm changed or not, Jordan. They're so close right now, those yeah, two. Why do you say stuff like She's that? Like She's in like... his nipple. I didn't, it hurts even, my feelings. I didn't even mean it to be. Why do you do that? I don't know. Like, are you dumb? When She's Jordan right, and I like... talk in private. This is in between us two. Is it? Well, yeah. Sure, go for it. First of all, look at me. Do you know that that's the most triggering thing that you could say to me? Saying that I'm not changed and that well, I don't act like that, and I won't say it. I'm human. I'm not. Is that thunder? Mm -hmm. I am going to With lightning. Up. Yeah, Just because I say something mean. Lightning is like thunder, right? Thunder is the sound that a lightning bolt makes, mm -hmm. but it's the same. Shit. Every once in a while doesn't mean that I haven't changed drastically. My oh, there go. What happened? Oh, it is her boyfriend. Oh, we met him at that other house. I just can't. The, the second I opened my mouth, she's like, can I talk to her alone? Yeah. She just like excused everybody so that she can manipulate Jordana and she does this every single time. Right. And she's going to like change the story and change Jordana's mind. Right. I am sorry that I got like that. You're hurt, I'm hurt. Hurt okay. people hurt people. So that's really what's going on here. So let's just like squash it. Yeah. Let's do better I in the agree. future. And from here on out, just talk to me because you know I love you. I, this is dumb. This is what she does like every single time. Why don't you go back over there? What was it that Chloe did? Chloe mm -hmm. basically called them out for having sex at the reunion. Mm -hmm. And then Chloe's like, I'm sorry. And then she makes it like the other person's fault too. And then mm -hmm. they're like, let's agree that we both need to change. Mm -hmm. She never takes accountability. So manipulative, yeah. Bad. So mean to me. And now you're like being nice Jordan, to me. look at me. Gaslight. Nobody's perfect. And I'm sorry that I said that. I don't even know why I said that. That's like. And now I feel bad because I was mad at you. I want to feel like that wasn't the real you. I'm back, Are you guys good now? You're solid. I wouldn't say solid, but we're like we're gonna better move, than what before. We're gonna move forward because that's what people do, right? Sometimes they just get toxic people out of their life. <laughs> you also like asked everyone to leave the second I put my mouth because you're trying to manipulate the situation. No, I'm not. I'm talking to my friend. She doesn't need you here to have a conversation. Anyway, so you guys are good. I'm gonna go hang out with my boyfriend. Okay, but I love you. Say it back. I'm sorry, but you realize that she asked everybody to leave so that she could do exactly what she just did, right? I love you, okay? I didn't mean it like that. Is that what I said? I'm changed. Then why do you keep doing this Like, shut the up. Like, that's toxic. She's a toxic person. I feel like I always want to believe the best in people. I know, I don't know why. I've always been like no, that. That's a good thing, but you like, also you have to like, recognize the people that are going to f you over every time. Yeah. I'm going home. Chris, please listen yeah. to me. Let's go home. I hate mm, Yeah, you're not gonna like being on the show, mm -hmm. my friend. Mm -mm. Hey, babe, will you come to bed? Mm. Is he a little bossy? When I'm done in the bathroom, I'll come to bed. You know what I appreciate about you? You let me do my thing in the bathroom and you're not like, hey, you come into bed? Or like, what are you doing in there? Take your time. You just let me do my thing and no. then when I come in, I'm coming in. He's on like, Did you rub yeah. a geode on your face? It's always nice to take off all the makeup and stuff. Yeah, once you reach your third shower of the day. <laughs> Shut up. That's completion form for you. <laughs> it's not a bad thing that I shower so much. You're smiling. That's good. Well, I'm just happy to be home with you, but I'm obviously really upset. 
Yeah. Nothing makes me more sad than getting called out for my own toxic behavior. You were the one that did say something was gonna happen. It's like I spoke it into existence. Yeah. And I, I do believe that everything happens for a reason, and I believe it was something that we're supposed to learn from. So just trust that that was something that was meant to happen. I know, I'm just embarrassed. I don't want you to, like, think badly of me or anything. I don't like the fake crying. Could, could you stop fake crying? <laughs> it's just, I, I, I think at times you can be reactive sometimes to people. And when you can hold yourself and pause before we speak to anyone, it's going to work a lot in our favor, especially with, with people that may want to trigger you. Well, I was obviously on about. edge a little bit because it's the first time I'm bringing you around this group, around all of this. It's like just intense and I was nervous. I wasn't always this nice love and light person. And I'm just scared of someone telling you something that I've done in the past. And I just don't want anything I've ever done to affect you and I. Well, of course, it's going to bother me a little bit. Yeah. Obviously, you want to avoid those situations in the future. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Yeah. Oh. She's like, how is this going to work? Baby. How you feeling? Yeah, I got to yoga this morning already. You did? Yeah. I'm still recovering from that party. Yeah. Just, you know, gathering myself a little yeah. bit. Chemistry, right? <laughs> yeah, that was so much fun. What do you um what do you got going on today? First on my to-do list is <laughs> um, up with Tom be your <laughs> awkward freak self. Sorry. There's something I want to talk to you about though. <laughs> is like everything okay what's up is everything okay what's up what's going does, on Let's does the car it. need a realignment i kind of thinking <laughs> why was he just walking just, like that i kind of thinking i kind of need like my own place it's nothing like nothing bad like i'm gonna be here all the time is anyway. there like any reason in particular or just the way you were just walking treat it like it's like my office like i'm gonna be there during the days sometimes and like work where it's like completely quiet and it's just me and there's no distractions i'll sleep there every once in a while <sighs> i i don't want anything to change between us you're I'm just really like, stressed you out can't really. do there's that. like a lot of commotion in this house and i love it but there's so many things I want to do with like my business. I need to yeah. learn about it more. I feel like you I don't, don't I mean, know. Then get an like office. Go to Barnes and Noble or something. Right. Like if you're really happy with him. I just think it would be nice to have a place where if I need to just really like get 12 hours of sleep or just have some peace and quiet that I, mean, I can go you to. You sleep for like 12 hours like every night. <laughs> I mean, when did you like decide this? Yeah. I just kind of just coming like, through the phone. Mm -hmm. I've been just thinking about it for the last couple of weeks. Then I just feel like. Like, have you like looked at apartments or like houses? Or... I looked with Amanda the other day, but I haven't found anything I like yet. I mean, so like you've been talking to like Amanda about it. She didn't even just, realize just that talking to people about it was. I mean, that's, don't you think like you would talk to me about that kind of first? I'm, really. I'm telling you, I like just decided this. I'm telling you like pretty early on, I swear. I, I, and I know how much you like me yeah. being transparent with you and being yeah. just open and honest. So I'm trying to do that. I just feel like communication is like our biggest I issue. Know, and that's what I'm you trying to I mean? do. And, like, I'm trying I don't to know. fix that. I feel like I'm the last one to find out. I don't know who you told, but no, apparently you're not Amanda, the you last know? one okay. to find out. Yeah. I told like a couple of my girlfriends mm -hmm. and that's it. And like the, all the producers and like, you know, everyone. Well, I would prefer it to have been before them. I know. But... Well, I'm telling you, like this was like literally yesterday that I told them. <laughs> That's great. I'm trying to be upfront with you. 
I just need it. I mean, you don't think we could have had this talk and like and us tried to fix it before, you know, going with Amanda to look at apartments? I don't want you to feel like I'm weird to calling me, like, the shots. You know, you move in, that was like a huge deal. And then now you're like doing a mini move out or something. It feels kind of like taking a step back, you it's know? It's not though. Yeah. And it's like, it's literally just going to be a place that I'm at like very rarely. I'm still going to be here almost every night, maybe like one night a week while I sleep there. It just definitely feels like we're like regressing in our relationship instead of moving forward. But I don't know. Please don't take it that no, way. No, no, no. I just literally sold all my gym equipment to make you an Please office here. Please don't make me feel bad. It just is going to make me feel more comfortable. Oh my God. It's not fair to cry at him like that. No, no. Where, where, where? You were just crying. He needs to break up with her. What he if he just broke up with her right now? He should. He should, he should be like, guess what? You're dumb. Yeah. It was weird to reflect on how I'd gotten to this point in my life. Plus, reflecting is weird. I invested so much emotion into my first love, but he was the wrong guy. I literally walked in on him sleeping with a girl. I'm so <laughs> do you guys miss Alex at all? I know you do. I do. He's more fun to hate like than Sam. Yeah. Yeah. Cheers to Blunt. New man who dis. Oh After god, Robin. Robin. I thought I'd stay single for a while to figure myself out. But then I fell for Sam. Perfect Sam. The kindest, sweetest, and hottest guy I knew. What is this even? Why are we taking a look back? And unfortunately, I wasn't sure I could be my best self living in Sam's shadow. Someone that I I knew I was ready to break free of that lifestyle. But would that mean breaking free of my relationship too? Yeah, yes, it does mean that. I found an apartment. I put the deposit down. This is gonna be so good for you. Yo, so Juliet's going to Paris. What? I don't know when she planned it. It's starting to seem like she's just seeing how far she can push. The lifestyle of Sam Logan is definitely not one you wanna walk away from. Do you even wanna try? No. Things have been a little off with us. You have this opportunity to like now lift others up. Yeah, Kelsey, Madison, Gary. Yeah, none we're of them all were those in that people. episode. Because they don't want to pay everybody. The cast was so big. Right. They don't put them in episodes. Yeah. You're a nasty, vindictive. <laughs> There's a lot of mind games going on in CSDQ. <laughs> oh, you gotta wait. When have I ever said that? Because I've been nothing but respectful to your friendship. You guys talk mad about me. Don't even lie. I was wondering if you would move in with me. Um, no. <sighs> Everything he's been posting on social media, I'm not gonna pretend like you guys haven't seen it. Everyone has seen it. So is that like Sam's new girl? Oh, is this the infamous man? Yeah, we've seen her. Oh, we You're gonna dig a knife into me like that? I'm tired of trying to save Juliet. So is it really over? Juliet's gonna have to save herself this time. Stop videotaping me, all right? What? I've never seen her kiss that Who's guy. Who's that guy? That's what I, th I think we didn't watch the whole, season. I don't think we watched the whole season. Well, we're going to watch the whole season we are. with you. In the next few months. Yeah, like right. We're going to spend the next few months of your life watching the rest of this season. Mm -hmm. And also let us know about... Just what you generally think about us. Yeah, or like <laughs> whatever's happening in your personal life. Sure. Like, Always down for yeah. that. See you later. I'll see you. Let's go do more other different things. <laughs> yeah. Face on the streets. Thank you, Annie. Thank you, Julia. Thank you, guys. Thank you.